there is another concept I did want to at least illustrate, um, and it's the idea of the planner, because I think this is a very hot topic and people often ask about it. So at least can show it off um, in Python. Uh, I will say that the C sharp version of the kernel is further along and has uh, a few other planners that um, that are you know that are maybe a bit more advanced, a bit more more custom. But to sort of illustrate what a planner is, right? In in Python, the idea is that it's it's actually mostly just prompt engineering in my mind, right? You effectively say like, okay, what what do you want the planner to do? And in this case, a basic planner is, right? Its job is to create a um, a human readable uh, set of steps or set of subtasks that the the AI can or the kernel can execute um, uh, execute on. So in this case, right, I specify some functions. So the kernel needs to know what functions it has available to it, um, so that it can create a, a good a plan based off those functions. You don't want it to deviate and make up uh, skills uh, if you haven't uh, uh, created them. Uh, but in this case, right, we specify, okay, these are the functions that you have available to it. Now, uh, for you know, for some goal, right. Uh, you know, now execute that, or sorry, uh, create a plan for that. So this is a JSON-based version of a planner, and a plan would look something like this, where there's an input, an initial input, uh, and these are the subtasks where it's like, okay, you know, based off this initial input, call the joke function, right? And then with that, pass that, uh, pass the output of this function, and make it the input of the next function. And you may need to specify some arguments, right, for for this uh, for this function. So so imagine that, right? I think uh, if if it's not um, if it's not clear, it, it's kind of magical that this happens, right? The AI is able to sort of take a set of functions. You can call them tools for if you want to think of it like that, and just sort of construct a plan to to say like okay I now know how I can actually execute um execute uh a a plan to to give you the ultimate goal so to illustrate again another example right if I say like okay tomorrow's Valentine's Day you come up with a few date ideas right uh my date likes Edgar Allan Poe right using his style and then email these things to to my significant other and also translate to French, right? All these sort of things you can imagine many steps, uh, and you for sure can, can, uh, implement this yourself and write these, uh, this chain of functions. Um, but right. That's, that's like a one-off, right? I think the idea for this sort of stuff is if you can let the planner, uh, do more of this heavy lifting, right. Um, that, that sort of, you know, makes it, uh, certainly much more, uh, much more scalable and, uh, yeah, anyway, so it's, this is the, a basic planner again, it's, it's sequential in nature, uh, and which means that, you know, it, it executes, it will create a plan like step-by-step step that you would have to execute in order. Um, and as I mentioned, right, there are many versions of planners that you can, uh, possibly create, and we certainly encourage you or your customers to, uh, explore that. Um, okay. So there's the plan creation, uh, and then there's also this, the plan execution, right? The, the creation piece is to create the human readable thing that you can verify that you can say, okay, this looks good. Um, and now you can call the, the, the execute, uh, plan on that. So let's see what that looks like in a notebook. All right, so here, right, uh, import a planner, um, import some skills, right? Uh, I in this case, I'm importing some uh, semantic skills as well as native skills, uh, and here I'm going to make an ask and create some new semantic functions as well. 
and register that to the kernel, make that available. Uh, and now I can call or create some new plans with that. And uh, with that plan, if it, all things look good, I can now then execute that plan. Um, and I, I wish I printed out the results here, but um, you can imagine what it, what it uh, hopefully could, could look like. Um, but yeah, that, that's basically about, you know, a very simplified kind of version of, of what the planner is. Uh, again, right, there's a very emerging hot topic. And uh, certainly from our side, we will add more uh, advanced versions uh, of this concept, um, you know, over time. But we certainly invite you all to uh, to play with it.